In this episode, Arrington goes to space, stocks up on some no water resources, and builds the storage warehouse interior. Wait, this isn't my warehouse. Whose clothes are these? Hey, oh, welcome to Minecraft. My name is Arrington, and today we are back in the Channel 64 SMP season two. So when we left off last episode, we had just finished excavating our storage warehouse. And in this episode, we are going to take that space and give it a makeover. But first, we need to go to space. Welcome. Launch sequence activated. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Warning. Failure to launch. Life form detected. Excuse me, what are you doing in my ship? What? I was, I was just gonna pop by the end real quick. But I, I did that already. Why, uh, why do you need to use my ship for it? Well, that's how we get to the end. Uh, do you know what you're doing? Do you, there's a lot of complicated equipment in there. But I'm a, no, I'm a great pilot. I've seen things to the contrary. It can't be any harder than flying a plane. Well, you, do you know how many knobs and switches there are there? It might blow your mind. I'm great with knobs and switches. Self-destruct sequence activated. What? No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Communication no. failure. What are you doing to my ship? No! So here is the warehouse as we left it. Not very interesting. So first we are going to need to get some walls in, which we did on the most recent Channel 64 stream day. Next, we need to get oh, some know, supports right. in, some shelves, and some hanging lighting, all of which require a massive amount of iron. So, after stealing some from the No Water Starter Iron Farm, I decided it was probably better for the economy to actually buy it from a shop that sells iron. So I bought all of it. But of course, we weren't done stealing because we still need a ton of white wool for the walls. Though technically Dave and I are business partners, so it's not quite stealing. Right, Dave? Nah, it's like how you don't mind me secretly living in your basement, right? Wait, what? What? And of course, no one visits No Water without visiting Old Bones Jones. I'm Old Bones Jones! Resemblance is really uncanny. Is this what I'll look like when I get older? TikTok filter was right. And with materials in hand and a lot less diamonds, we return home to start adding some of the warehouse atmosphere to our build. Okay, so we're nearly done with the warehouse here, but we have a delivery, a, a book here. We've got, let's see, I have hidden my favorite mini block somewhere in your base. The job is to find it. Once you found your, once found, you should hide your favorite mini block head in someone else's base. Have fun, duds. Okay, so this should be hidden from Harwood then. Uh, luckily, we just put in these shelves, so I don't think it should be here. Um, let's start. We will look up in the starter area in our kind of bunker up here. Okay, so I don't see any mini blocks here in the bunker that we didn't put here ourselves. So that leaves the plane. It's kind of unfortunate. We've got a, a small bit of building here. There's not too many places to hide things just yet. All right, so mini blocks around the plane. Um, so these are ones I've left. The excavation bundle, the chest, these are the ones I like. Um, crate. Got the globe, that's definitely another Arrington special. Books, um... Where could it be? Is it inside something? How creatively was this hidden? Am I gonna have to, like, really search for this? Because there are some, some creative spots. Did birds see anything? Okay, so we just put in the shelves, but maybe we were wrong? How, how quick is Harwood? <laughs> has, he, has he hid the head in the shelves? 
<laughs> no, he, he is not. Okay, so on our way to the shelves, we check on top of the bunker. And we have pancakes. Uh, oh, did that pop on top? Oh, no, there it is. Wow, that was a weird placement for that. Ah, oh, the... Okay, now we've got to admire the pancakes. Where's a good spot to set them? This is a beautiful, a beautiful choice. Look at the little butter. That is, that's great. Okay, so now we have to go pick out ours. Okay, so I, I, I love the mob heads. Where are they at? Um, here we go. Uh, oh man, there's so many good ones to choose from. This season, I've really liked the copper pipes. Um, the book stacks always great, but I don't want to pick something that somebody else might have picked too. Um, okay, so TNT is always one of my go tos. I think maybe the globe. The globe really fits in with my adventurer aesthetic, and I have been using that a lot this season. There are so many good mob heads in here. Okay, let's go with the globe. Now, we've just got to find somebody's base to hide this at, and I think Loki's would be perfect because I have been meaning to visit since the new build, and I want to check it out in person, so let's go do that. Alright, I'm excited to check out Loki's base because the, the scale here is just ridiculous. Look at this. Oh, the poor guys are trying to get some air, Loki. <laughs> That's so sad looking. <laughs> I don't like that at all. We gotta go. Loki, you need to give them some air. Okay, here we go. Uh, we have to hide the globe here. Oh, there's so many places to hide it. I kind of just want to throw it right here in with all the green. Poor Loki's gonna have so many places to look. Uh, hello, sir. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is so big. Okay, here, what do we what do we have down here? Uh, it is a Loki base, of course, so we've got some farms. What is this? Villagers? Um, it's like a breeding chamber? Yeah, okay, villager breeding. We've got the crops down there. Looks like they're going... Okay, I remember this. This was done on one of the Channel 64 livestream days. He was moving villagers. Okay, what do we have? We've got glow lichen. Hey, they're all coming back down. Were you guys up there just because I was or for air? Oh, you've got bubbles too. All right, well, they're moving around a little more, so that's good. What do we have here? What is this? Okay, melon, pumpkin. Nice, nice. Uh, two tall flowers. Sugar cane. I'm not seeing anywhere better to hide our globe yet. Because I think hiding in greenery is probably going to be our best option. Loki has a very modern base aesthetic. A lot of trees, lots of dark greens. I don't want to hide it in one of these trees. I don't want to hide it too hard. Like, that, it's never going to be found. Which I feel like anywhere could be. Um, also, I just realized showing you on video where I hit it is probably not the best idea. Whoa, look at this! Waterlogged leaves with... That's awesome. Ooh, and the... Oh, that coral looks awesome. That's so cool! Alright, so I'm gonna hide this off camera a little bit, and then let's get back to building. And so at this point, we've got most of our warehouse done. We've got all the shelves in, the supports, the hanging lights. The only thing left is to start filling in these shelves. So I think that's going to take some time. We're going to do some of that on streams, as well as if you have any ideas for what we should put on these shelves, make sure you leave a comment down below. Uh, I want to do kind of themes. So maybe like this one's got treasure and diamonds and another one's got some just general things maybe one's got some lore bits uh, we have lots of shelves and lots of different things to work with and so i'm excited to start filling those out so what's next though uh, i want to start by connecting the front of the warehouse to the river it's going to be a mess for a minute but hopefully it'll make sense by the next episode of course there was that errand that i needed to run in no water
Love you, bye.